With every vibration of an air chisel. Just behind this rock face, we should be looking at something. With every scratch of a dental tool. You know, that's actually kind of profound just to think about that, like, your eyes are the first to have ever looked at that particular part of that animal, uh, ever. Speck by speck, flake by flake, the curtain of 66 million year old rock is pulled back. It is painstaking. Closer than we think. It is precise. And what is emerging is considered one of the finest dinosaur skulls ever found, of a T-Rex. It's remarkably intact. All on public display behind glass at the Burke Museum. Yeah, it looks good, yeah. It hasn't even been a full 18 months since the skull and its protective plaster jacket was delivered to the Burke's loading dock. It was found in the Hell Creek Formation of eastern Montana. We just got lucky and the place we were going just happened to be this boulder with some bones sticking out of it. Jason Love and Luke Tufts are amateur paleontologists and UW alums who found it. We were uh, deciding whether or not to turn tail and come back to Seattle or go out for one last little hike. Sometimes it's just the one more look around that pays off. This is the midline of the skull. Michael Holland is a fossil preparator. Yes, that's his job title. He used to work at the Smithsonian, then took this job. He's also from Montana. Eye sockets are right here, mm -hmm. so ours are there and there. A 3D model of a typical T-Rex skull helps orient me. So there's your nose. The goal for, for the new Burke when we open up is to, to put the skull on display there. That's in 2019. This is the eye socket, so you can see some of that emerging and then more exposure happened down here and it was apparent that, wow, we have a whole upper jaw here and it, it just kept getting better and better and better. And has lots of help, much of it from volunteers, all to bring the full picture of this apex predator into full view. In Seattle, Glenn Farley, King 5 News.